later. We and we're about to get a tour oh, yeah, from right. Mark D. Line, who's the producer of Hill Center Theater. I'm sure it's going to be awesome. I can't wait to see it. So, Hill Center Theater's new building cost $80 million to build. Really fashionable attire to wear. Check our outfits out. Looking so fine. This place is still under construction. It has two and a half weeks until they open. But they open should be part, the part of the theater. Two more months until it's all the way open. They're performing in two weeks, which is, it's, it's going to be awesome. <laughs> There's two stages here. Two. One's circular, and one is this, which is the jewel box. We're sneaking backstage here. As you can see, this is really, really massive. The stages are connected um, backstage. Our changing rooms, when we're dressing up for our costumes. Five times bigger than my room, at least. Well, the green room. <laughs> but the green room is supposed the to be The green up there. room. Is it? Yeah. Okay, so this room right here is like a workout room. It's gonna be, it's not here yet. It's gonna be a workout room for like Before Joseph. We go on stage. Yeah, for Joseph, because like Joseph, almost all the guys are shirtless, and so if they want to look buff, which so I see most fly. guys do. Exactly. It's so cool. Just playing right. stinko bathrooms. All right, so in the show, there's always that person that takes a dump in the dressing room, and everybody smells it for like, you know long time. So, they have so we've provided bathroom bathrooms, bathrooms, bathrooms that are far away from the dressing room so that other cast members don't hate you. The stage is twice as fast as the current one oh. and it's Whoa. twice as quiet. Oh, <laughs> if it's at full capacity, you would not be able to stay on it. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> the flight system can travel at six feet per second. Oh. That's almost a free fall. So you can see they're using lasers to make sure that the slip stage can slide in and out here perfectly. This is just the wig room, guys. They have a room for wigs. For wigs. It's beautiful. So here we are, going into the deepest, darkest pits of hail. Get it, guys? The deep, the deep dark pits of hail. <laughs> Here is the pit. This is underneath the stage. This is underneath the round stage, I believe. It's so much deeper when you look. Oh my gosh. The mass of the, the scale of these stages. This steel is so far super, down. Super I think that, that, that thing that says two on it is a place where actors can stand so that they raise up with the stage. I could be wrong. We do say whenever the stage is moving during Christmas Carol, we'll say "Bah humbug." That way, everybody knows that the stage is moving and nobody's gonna like fall over and kill themselves. Okay, this stage right behind me, just this middle section here, these stages is about 126,000 tons. Well, it's just built and uh, fabricated in London, assembled, tested. Casey and some of our crew went over, made sure that they were familiar with it, that it was working the way they wanted it. Hey, and then they disassembled it and shipped just, it over. Just be with okay. I had my hard head on. This building, if it were all above ground, it would be an 11-story building. <laughs> but one-third of this building is underground. We've had the opportunity to be in a few of their shows and to have seen them, and they're incredible. And this is just going to envelop you even more with all the screens they have and all the technology. It's going to be crazy. You're going to go check it out. Hi, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching, and we will see you guys next week. I love how the lemon rice catch rates have become the top.